Hi, so we we'll continue our discussion on uh, radiations. Like I said, what happens when our natural body system get invaded by foreign radiations? Our body can withstand maximum radiation of 30 nano Tesla. Reports from USA, Sweden and other countries says, you know, if it exceeds that, if it goes up to 50, 60, 70, 80 nano Tesla, there's a serious cause of cancer. It can cause cancer. It is carcinogenic. So be careful about that. Cancer cases, you know, can be treated, healed, eliminated if they are detected early with alternative therapies like controlling the pH value and neutralizing your home or office or your place of stay from radiation. We know electromagnetic radiation, electromagnetic frequency by another name, it's called e-smoke. Electronic smoke, the smoke which comes from electronic devices, especially mobile and Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is very dangerous. I would suggest you switch off your Wi-Fi when not in use. Digital signals are normally pulsating in continuous signals. Suppose you have a mobile, it is always seeking the signal from the service provider. It is always on and it is like, you know, continuous radiation shower on your body and you are always with your mobile you keep it in your pocket in your jeans pocket in your near your bed while you sleep so that is very dangerous basically what happens what does radiation do high radiations like G, be it geopathic stress or electromagnetic radiation or high frequency sources they alter our cell structure our body cell structure they break off the cell bonds, the chemical bond between the cells and they cause cell mutation. They change the form of the cell, the spin of the cell, the structure of the cell and sometimes they completely destroy the cell and they destroy the communication system between the cells. Suppose your hand cells are communicating with your brain cells and when you are affected by these radiations, geopathic radiations or electromagnetic radiation, they break down that communication system and it is the cause of many diseases and ailments and problems. They make your body more prone to ailments because they break down your cell structure. So normally if you can withstand a disease or you can withstand the onset of a disease, because your body has become weak because of radiation and you cannot withstand that and you become more susceptible to diseases you are easily attacked by these diseases. 80% of the miscarriages or abnormal deliveries or autism in children are caused by these radiations. If you can neutralize your place, neutralize your home or wherever you stay, your office from these radiations, you can get rid of a lot of these problems. You can be very safe and you can have a healthy life. It, these radiations affect our brain. In children, it affects their uh, learning capabilities, attention span, hyperactivity, skin problems, memory loss, asthma, blood sugar fluctuation, your diabetes. Diabetes is a very common problem now. Heart problems, fluctuation in your heart rate. Cancer. Cancer is caused by these radiation. Even uh, WHO, World Health Organization, has confirmed this. They say, Mobile signals cause cancer. 